this is how to use Ares, a avatar, host uh, well, I don't know about this API bullshit, there you go. Uh, you need to do an API key from the Discord uh, or website, I will link the Discord description, or you can find it in the things. So, this will let you, like, search avatars and shit. Anyway, so, we'll just quickly try to install it, because why not? You go over here, you go to the Ares thing, you click on this thing, installs. Ah, uh, wait, you don't even have to get it. Ah, uh, cool, you, you click this one, and then you click on, like, Ares, whatever the fuck, and then you go here to the latest release. The latest release is this version, like I said, and then you're going to click on this one. Great. They also apparently updated this yesterday, because we are trying to update. But yeah, this, this is what they're going to get, the installer. Once you've installed it and ran the installer, you will get big greeted to this. But you're probably wondering, but it says open Unity. How do I get Unity? Well, if you don't know, you're fucking monk, but download Unity Hub, go to use Unity Hub. Why not open? There you go. Uh, you want to go to just installs, click install editor, you click uh, archives, you click download archives, then from download archives, you're gonna like, it's just gonna load for 10 minutes because Unity's not such dog shit. You go to 2019, scroll all the way down to see 31, it was released 30th September. 31, you click Unity Hub and Unity Hub will download it for you. Great. And there you go, big spooks. Next, you're probably wondering. But how do I upload it? Well, you're going to need an SDK. You can use Bloodborne. Alright. Uh, you could use Bloodborne. I push it, Google it, find it. It's, uh, I don't know where it is. To be fair, if you have it for now, I'll let you use it. Ah, here it is. <laughs> Bloodborne. You can use the Bloodborne SDKs, which I actually, I actually would suggest are pretty good. They're pretty good for people that rip or edit avatars, but if you don't rip or edit avatars, I suggest, well, you don't, if you don't rip avatars, I suggest using VRChat. So you want to go here, first thing, disable API, reload API, boom, API loads. Now let's say we want a skin. We're going to want a rough skin, the one I'm always using anyway, we speak. We click rust. It loads. Very fucking slowly. Anyway, uh, yeah, you find whatever one you want. So like, we just look for one, whatever, you go through avatars, you'll find all of them. You can rip them, I'll show you how to do that on here as well in a minute, but yeah, I'm just looking for an avatar I like the look of. Because I've got to upload this to my account, I don't really want to upload some shitty avatar I'm not going to use. Um, let's do that one, fuck it. So we're doing this one, next you want to click open unity. So this is how you hot swap, this is what we're here for, hot swap tutorial, da 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 da. Uh, since you don't like the other guy that talks on the tour, you should hear anyway, okay? Because his voice is annoying or whatever the fuck, or whatever your reasons for not liking him is. Maybe because your favorite VR chat creator is cause of a cunt for being a dickhead or whatever. You're here because you don't like the other guy. You click the hot spot button. Very, very simple. Very in-depth. Once you click the hot spot button, the thingy is going to install. The thingy has installed. Once it's like you've logged in or whatever, uh, you want to click build. You then wait. It's a very, very slow process. Probably gonna edit these bits out to be fair of you. Viewer retention and that. Done. We're here. Okay, there you go. This is the part where you upload your avatar. You then click hot swap. And then a thing is meant to appear, but it hasn't appeared. Uh, they click the button. Now uh, you give it a second, because apparently it's fucking thinking. There's the button. Ah, uh, the thing appears. This is how you do window. Now, of course, we know some of you want to want the quest, so we will go over the quests. Done. You, you've got it, I think. Is it here? Is it here? There it is. There you go. It's here. So you can just call it whatever you want. Rusk. Lol. Just have a description being. I like. Oh, wait, no, here. I like cake. There you go. Simple. And then you just click upload. Oh, wait. You can click this button first, and then you click upload. Done. Well, now you've done, now you've done something. Now you're probably wondering, but how do I do quest? Because for some reason, no one explains quest. Like, I'm not seeing it. Thank you. Done. No one explains how to do quest for some reason. I figured it out earlier, so. 
nothing like I said you can expand repair, this just lets you beam packets, all of that bullshit, who cares. I have to once. I actually don't know what this does, to be fair with you. I'll be, I'll be honest, I don't know what that does. Anyway, yeah, so now you've got it, but you're probably wondering, but how do I do quests? Because there actually ain't a tutorial for quests, so I'm going to show you the quest. Um, you press X on this, you then go to, back to your Unity Hub. Let's open the Unity Hub, my children. You go back to the Unity Hub from here, you will click uh, this button, Editor version. Now you will need to download the Android version, which will, you can just download, you just click Add Platform, and then there, we click Android. Open with Unity. Boom. Now it's going to migrate all your bullshit to the Quest avatar stuff. Now, this is how you upload to Quest. Because I know a lot of people don't really tell you, you need to do this in the same goal, to be fair. Like, a lot of people, I've not seen anyone show you how to hot, hot swap to both Quest. Like, everyone just kind of assumes you to know that you need to have the Android version. Uh, Alright, well, we're back. Okay, so this is now the Android version. You build and publish to Android. Same as the other version, except on the Android client, because again, no one shows you how to hot swap for Quest. Rip you Quest users don't want to hot swap. I don't know how you'll hotswap even by PC since you're using a fucking quest, but we'll figure that one out when we get there. Now, once you've done this, it will bring up this. Okay, you can click this, which you can go to pull back. You can click this. So, this is going to say it's the same one, which is the Rascal Law skin. So, you go back onto Aries. You then click hotswap. And you click quest. Now, you find an avatar that has a quest version that's been downloaded. Okay, not every avatar has a quest version. Once you've done this, uh, you will now just click upload. I've set this to be allowed to be a fallback, but yeah, you can just click upload. And boom, now you have a quest back up, I guess. Uh, you, let's say you upload to quest, you can do either, I don't think that works, upload. Food, you gonna load? There you go, we've loaded. Hello, we're back. Okay, so, again, I'm using world client, it's pretty much my main client, just for anyone that's wondering why I'm always using this, not void or something. Alright, there you go, the Rusk Low Avatar. Now, if we click on this, uh, I actually don't have this downloaded, there you go. Now, we have the... Let's click change, oh, there you go. I'll probably add this colour scheme at some point, but I'm lazy. Oh, uh, where's the mirror? Where's the mirror on my boat map? Where is the mirror on the boat map? Uh, boat mirror. There's a pool in it. That's not where the pool is, the pool is over there. Why am I retarded? Door. Pool. Okay, then we click up here, we're gonna click, uh, colliders on, because I don't know why there's no colliders. And full mirror, there you go. So yeah, there we have the avatar, beast poop. We have the, I'm probably gonna add this one as a, are they actually positioned on this? I'll check. Oh, there is. Ooh, I like. Oh, I might be in these. One sec, can I change color of these? They're all blue. Okay, you guys. So yeah, you're probably wondering, but I have the quest I was talking to fullback. Just change fullback. You can change fullback to this one. And there you go. Technically, it's not actually the fullback. I think it just shows us the fullback because I'm weird. But yeah, you guys. I don't have quest, so I can't really show you. I have to change the fullback. But yeah. We have the rainbow colored one. So I'm going to be a maid. We'll be a maid. Which one's made? This made. Well, there you go. Pretty simple. How to hustle up. Uh, yeah. Au revoir.